The goal of this video is to try and take photos like these and turn them into Peter McKinnon's floating cup photo. This is some just like generic like fishing line. So you're gonna strap it to like the ceiling and then hold a mug and I wanna try and recreate that, so. Okay, so basically all I ended up doing, if you saw the shots, I kinda just like held the phone where I was. And I also did a video, I'm gonna try and do like a mask on it. It should be really easy, but what I did do that is like really important. So tie it to the easiest point where it's not gonna disrupt your subject. I was thinking about tying it right around the side underneath the Canon logo and around, but that would have made it a lot harder for me to go in with my computer and take out all of that fishing line. We got a bunch of prisons over here. And look, there's one for me. And now it's time for the editing. So basically what I have to do is really, I'm gonna take the photo, make sure that you have the clone brush tool, which is right there. And you're going to take that and use a small enough circle. And you're gonna basically just go in a little section. So you're gonna go up, 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 all the way down. Like the metal part on the camera, that part is gonna be the hardest part. You really just have to like use the bracket keys on your keyboard um, to make your circle smaller. That should be it. I know that the recording of me yesterday, I was kind of really tired, but if you guys like this kind of content, make sure you guys subscribe for more. I really want to try DIY like filming setups. So this next video I'm filming right now is actually... Ah!